Alright, today we're going to show you how to check out the Calvel Android uh, application from our CVS server. Um, to do so, you want to open up Eclipse and go to File Import. Um, you want to open up the CVS folder here, and then click on Projects from CVS. Uh, next, you click Next. Uh, then what you're going to want to do here is click on a create a new repository location so that you can actually enter in your details here. Um, the host for this is going to be whopper.csl.mt.edu and our repository path is going to be forward slash group underscore projects slash cs4760 slash s10 slash group 5 slash source underscore code and note that there is no slash after source code uh, next you're going to enter in your username and your password and you're going to select the connection type here this is actually going to be ext ssh so select that and click next here um, now we need to select the project that we're actually going to check out from the CVS. So click on use an existing module right here and then click on cs4760.cowbell. Uh, then all you have to do at this point is click finish and it should actually import it. Give it just a second here. It should connect up, grab all of the stuff for it, and you can actually see that it has shown up over here. Um, now typically, um, it'll say that there's a couple errors. So what we do here is we select the two errors, uh, and then we're going to right click on this and select delete say yes and then at this point you have a fully working copy of the Calvel software so now what we're going to try and do here we're going to click on Calvo then we're going to click on run we're going to run this as an Android application and I'm pretty sure it should be starting up the emulator right here Alright. Let's take a minute for this emulator to load here. and give it about another 20 seconds click on menu and then it should start up here in just a minute we can actually can make it start up ourselves too. Yeah. alright and there you go there is the cowbell in its full glory right here um, thanks for watching and Get to programming.